how to play the game! That is an epic fucking intro, dude. And I have to warn everyone, warning, what you may see right now is going to be absolutely disgusting. Sound good? Sounds good to me. Oh boy, the teeth! Oh no! Yo, get ready, here it comes. I gotta do it. Oh! Oh! They chose my braiding! Oh! Oh! The pinch, the pinch, the pinch, and the pinch, and a pinch, 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 and a pinch, 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 shocks. We got a pinch, a pinch, a pinch, a pinch, and a pinch, 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 and a pinch, pinch, shock. Oh my god. Yo, it's so fucked up. Oh my god. We got a pinch, and a pinch, and a shocking shock, and a pinch, and a pinch, and a pinch, 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 and a pinch, oh, shock. You ready? Shock and all. Wow. Yeah. Wow. He actually doesn't have emotions like that in him. No sympathy, no empathy. He's a sociopath. He is a sociopath. And what I mean by that is he has no empathy, sympathy, or morality in him. He literally just doesn't have that capability. So this is true, this is documented. Of me hitting balls and umps as we speak. Hey, you can't talk to me, buddy. Hey, where do you think you're going? Damn. Now, how the fuck did he see me exactly? Hey, where do you think you're going? How did they see me? That didn't make any sense. I was a million, a million miles away, and they fucking saw me. Well, this dragon, you're right. He says, half the people that watch DSP don't like him. They're only here to make fun of him, but I'm actually not talking about people who are being nice in the chat. You're right. The thing is, that's the nature of the beast. When you're an online content creator, you can't help who watches you, correct? This is why I stopped caring about viewers ages ago. I don't care how many people watch me. I care about how many people... Give me money. I have meaning for that the content that I make truly is important to them, and they'll support it. How do you think it is that I'm someone who only gets a few hundred viewers a stream, but I make a living doing this? Because people appreciate what I do. Because I don't make schlock garbage content like Rich does. So people come out in droves to support the content because they, they believe that it stands for something better than the trash that's out there on the internet. That's why I'm successful. That's why people like him get desperate. So that's, it's, it's really easy to figure out, but people just can't fathom. Hello? Oh, it's this a cult Nigel. or something. There's a cult here. Please be quick. People like what I'm I do because I'm not a dick. The United States of so yeah, it is. It's a cult. It's 100% this is a cult. Right? Ladies and gentlemen, it is time for a special unboxing. Live on today's stream, my new fighting game joystick arrived. Okay? Brand spanking new. Also, one of the highest rated models that you can get right now for fighting games. And as a result, I'm going to be playing fighting games moving forward on PlayStation 5. Um, it is the Kanba Obsidian 2 arcade joystick for the PS4, PS5, and PC. It will not work on Xbox Series X, okay? But it has the highest grade Sanwa parts. These are like the ones that are top, tippity top tournament parts that everyone says are like, you know, this is what you want on your joystick if you're playing in competitive tournaments. So, we're going to unbox it live. Alright, as you can see here, on the back, performance features. PS5 and PS4 compatible, create button that will share on PS4. It's like if you want to post up like videos and, and stuff. Sanwa lever and Sanwa 30mm buttons, square restrictor gate, 3.5mm headphone jack built in, which I'll never use because if I do then I can't get audio out for my streams. Uh, turbo button, anti-slip bottom pad, touch pad, wired USB cord length of 9 feet. <clears throat> there you go. And it has a weight of 7.5 pounds. It's a 7.5 pounder. It's a very heavy joystick meant to give you a lot of like heft so it doesn't move around on your lap when you're playing. Okay? All right, let's uh, let's try this sucker out. Okay. So we've got the little instruction book. Not that you'll ever need it. You just plug it in, right? I'm sure there's like a, sw a slip on it or something on it that says like, oh, PS4, PS5. Ah, they got a nice little cardboard thing here covering your joystick so it wouldn't get destroyed in, in transit. That's nice. 
I said cardboard, didn't I? I meant styrofoam. I'm stupid. All right, here we go. Nothing else. So, there we go. Take this uh, styrofoam off. It's a beast. It's twice as wide as, like, my other joystick. It's really wide. It's a good-looking stick. All right. So, there we go. Wow. It is sleek. Look at that. It is a sleek black joystick. That is like like a mirror. You could I can see my reflection perfectly in it. Holy crap. Interesting. DSP sucks big baloney dicks. So, buttons. It's got L3 turbo. I don't even know what this one is. Mute R3. I don't know what that one is. And it's got different switches. PS5, PS4, PC mode. Locked and unlocked. Now, this is very important. All right? The locked mode means nothing will input when you push it, which is great, because what if you want to clean your joystick, right? So you lock it, now you can't accidentally activate it. Or what if you're in a tournament, but you don't want something to go off, you lock it until you're ready for your match. So that lock switch is very important, I'm glad it has that, that's nice, I'll be able to e easily clean it. Um, here's the Sanwa stick, oh my god, it feels so different than my other joystick, really. It feels so different. Now each button actually has plastic on top of the button. It actually has a plastic, this is Kanba. Can you see it? It says Kanba on each one of these stickers for this for the buttons. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to remove that from each one of the buttons. Wow, it's nice. It's got a good weight. It definitely has a good weight to it. Wow, the bottom is cool. Oh, wow, I can't wait to show you guys. The, bo the bottom looks sweet. Look at that. All right, anyway, let me take these things off the buttons first. This is a really good joystick. I'm not kidding. This is probably the best joystick I've ever owned. I don't think I've ever owned one that's been this, this quality and this, this cost. You know, it's expensive. It's expensive joystick. Quite frankly... If you really want to know the truth, I think the people who free, who have midlife crises, people who have a very, very traditional formulaic life, okay? People who have a job that they absolutely hate, but they're stuck in it because they need to bring in the money to support their family. You know, the wife and the kids who, yeah, you love them, but at the same time, you may start to look back and say, man, I'm trapped in this life. And if I actually wanted to do something different with my life, I can't anymore. Because of the life decisions that I've made, I'm now stuck in this pattern. And you know what I mean? That's kind of what causes a midlife crisis. And that's when you hear, oh, the guy runs out and he, he frivolously spends crazy amounts of money to buy a fucking you know, sports car for himself in the middle of his life for no freaking reason. You know what I mean? A lot of, it's hilarious. Trolls have come to the chat now to basically crap on me unboxing my joystick. It's great, isn't it? Yeah, it's nice jealous idiots. All right. Let's get these idiots out of there. All right. Banned, 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 banned. Gone. Forever. It comes off. All right. And what you have in here is an alternate joystick top. It's a different shape. See that? So you can go with the original ball style that most Sanwa joysticks come with. Or you can replace the ball with the more traditional joystick. See that? It's a lot taller. Oh, let me put... There you go. Now I can see it better. See that? It's kind of neat. You have the option to go between two different joystick styles. Your call what you want to do there, right? Pretty nice. I'll keep the ball style. That's the one I'm used to playing with. But this is kind of nice. This has a taller stick with this almost like like diamond cut to the top of it. See that? It's kind of nice. All right, so that's what's on one side. Let's replace this hinge now. Or this uh, door now. And it wow, it's super easy to open and close. You scroll it right back up, open and close. That's so nice. And now on this side, you've got your USB cable. Let's take a look at it. So here it is. And quite frankly, I'm probably just going to leave that open. You would want to store it for travel or storage. But for me, I'm going to be using this joystick when I play Street Fighter every, you know, every session. So I'll just take out the whole cable here. Unwind it. And what happens is there's a little hole in the back. And what you do is you put the cable in there. See that? And now you can reattach your side. Very easily. This is a very well-designed joystick. There you go. And now you got your, your, your cord. It's a long, nine foot long cord. Pretty darn long. See that? Reinforced too. 
It's the kind that has that little fancy thing on. I don't even know what that does, but there you go. All right, now, taking a look here on the bottom of the joystick. It is fully rubberized. The entire bottom. It's not just like a spot or two. The entire bottom is rubberized, which is really, really nice. I'm, I am. I'm pretty much to the point where, yeah, I'm financially destitute. It sucks. So it is what it is. Um, now I'm curious. It has a little thing that says open and close, right? Can I just simply open the stick by touching that? I don't know. Let me take a look. So I opened it. Oh crap. You know what it is? It's easy access to the bottom of your joystick so you can replace the ball top with the other top. That way you don't have to disassemble your whole joystick if you want to try the different top. You can just do it. Because what it is, it has a little thing where you put a screwdriver in there and you hold it in place and then you just twist the top and the ball top will unscrew and pop off. So it's an easy access to change the top of your joystick. Nice. And I might try it because I've never actually tried that other top before. So that's pretty cool. Wow. So there you go. The combo, Obsidian 2 joystick for PlayStation 5. I'll be using this starting tomorrow when I start playing Street Fighter 6 online. Um, I can't wait to try it. It's going to be fun. I'm playing it all day tomorrow. So it'll be pretty fun to, to mess around with it and try it out and, uh, and see how it works. It's got the little touchpad there. Yeah, it's going to be neat. I'm excited to uh, test it. By the way, headphone jack is at the top. If you don't care about capturing and you plug in your headphones there, you'll have audio. The problem is if you do that, it'll mute your, your uh, audio out on your console. So if you're streaming, you can't really do that. All right. But, uh, all right. Good stuff. So that is the unboxing. Pretty simple. Nothing much to it. It's pretty, you know, it's a nice joystick. It's high grade. It's great parts. It's got nice features like those side, you know, compartments that screw on and off easily. Um, feels nice. It's got a nice texture to the bottom here. There's like a texture to it. You can feel with your hand. It's not smooth. It's like a texture that you can feel with your fingers there, which is very nice. And uh, I can't wait to try it. All right, guys, that is it. Hope you enjoyed the unboxing and looking at the features of the joystick. Uh, and I'll be using it soon. I'll let you know what it's like once I get my hands on a game, right? All right. Thanks a lot for watching. Thanks for watching. All right, that's it for now. I'm going to upload. I'll be back tonight, 6.45 p.m. Pacific time with the premiere of Chrono Trigger on my late stream. Okay, everyone? See you then. If not, tomorrow, Street Fighter 6 all day long with that joystick, all right? Okay, guys, peace out. There's still this back here. And it's still in the back of my neck, the back of my head, the back of my mind. And it's always telling me. It's WWE Champions time. I love it. I love it. Is, is a mobile game addict. Still has indoctrinated children who send him money. Blatantly milking for money it's a money pit it's gone just gone like that in an instant fucking gone i just care about money that i just can't help it i ebay contributions are mandatory but i need your help i am appealing directly to you no decency no respect no common sense no fucking maturity is the guy who just doesn't get reality <laughs> Ha 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 ha!